Hey guys, I have a fun tutorial for you today that will show you how to create a center pattern that you could incorporate into your wall hanging. Something like this would look great with a few more layers added to the sides and then brought together in the front of your work. Let's get started. For your setup, cut one piece of string that is six feet in length. Cut 12 pieces of string that are four feet in length and set aside. Fold your piece of six foot string so that there is two feet on the left side and four feet on the right side and attach it to the left side of your dowel using a lark's head knot. Attach it to the right side of your dowel using a lark's head knot. Attach the remaining 12 pieces of string to the middle section by folding each piece in half and attaching using a lark's head knot. Using the outside left cord as your filler cord, tie 12 double half hitch knots moving to the right. You can decide whether you want to keep the line of knots on a curve as seen here or push them down your filler cord to create a straighter line. Repeat on the right side of your work. Tie one more double half hitch knot with the two middle cords. We will tie another row of double half hitch knots on both sides of our work. Skip the first two cords and use the next cord as your filler cord. Tie eight double half hitch knots moving to the right. Later on, we will be tying a diamond in the middle of our work, so we want to leave some space here for that. Repeat on the right side of your work. Tie another row of double half hitch knots on both sides of your work. Skip the first two cords and use the next cord as your filler cord. Tie five double half hitch knots moving to the right. Repeat on the right side of your work. Tie a final row of double half hitch knots on both sides of your work. Skip the first two cords and use the next cord as your filler cord. 
Tie two double half hitch knots moving to the right. Using the inside left cord as your filler cord, tie four double half hitch knots moving down and to the left. Repeat on the right side of your work. Feel free to create whatever design you'd like in the middle of your diamond. I'm going to create a woven design by bringing the two inner right cores over top then under the cords on the left before tying two double half hitch knots to start to form the bottom of my diamond. Bring the two outer right cords underneath and over top of the cords on the left and then tie two double half hitch knots. Tie four double half hitch knots on the right side of your work. Tie one more double half hitch knot with the two middle cords. Feel free to leave it as is or if you want to add a little extra detailing follow along by adding double half hitch knots underneath the diamond. I'm adding two rows on both sides. The first row consists of three double half hitch knots then one extra double half hitch knot to connect the sides. And the second row consists of one double half hitch knot then an extra double half hitch knot to connect the sides. Thanks so much for watching. If you like this video, it would really help me out if you could hit the thumbs up below, and if you think this tutorial may be useful for others, please feel free to share it. I love to see your work, but sometimes I can miss it, so please tag me on Instagram or Facebook if you've used one of my tutorials or if you're using some of my supplies so I can see your work. Don't forget to subscribe for weekly video tutorials. Thank you!